Hey guys, it's been a while since I've played one of my favorite heroes of all time, Cyclops. I usually play him as the jungler, but in this game, I decided to play him as the support instead, which he's still pretty good at. The enemies have a very meta-oriented composition, and some might think that Cyclops won't be able to match their firepower. But even Mythical Glory rank, Cyclops can still do very well if he's played properly. Mathilda is very scary right from the start, so gotta play a bit more passive until I reach level 2. I need to clear the minion wave first so I can reach level 2, then I can help my team. It's a good idea to keep harassing their supports, so your team will have the advantage when rotating. Our Popo seems to be lagging. Sad face. Oof, that was close. I almost died because of the unforeseeable event. Granger is still trying to kill Benedetta, she's one shot away from dying, but as the jungler, you don't want to be too greedy just for a kill. Here, I saw that the enemies were moving towards the bottom lane, so I decided to go bot as well and see if we could counter gank them. Our Ling is in position, if I can hold their jungler, Ling shall have a good shot at finishing him off. Matilda is very strong indeed, but they are overly underestimating Cyclops damage output. I'm constantly paying attention to the map and checking if my teammates are following through. If they are not, I will not commit to the fight. Just ulting him to scare him away, so he cannot even try to steal it with his retribution. Yoink. 
The reason why I'm using the support emblem, because I know I'll be using the spell flicker quite often to secure the kills. You probably know by now, but getting MVP is my priority. Who cares about winning? Winky face. Granger did such an excellent job, now I will have less competition. I can almost taste the MVP already. I was just trying to harass them a bit, but making Chang waste her ultimate is a bonus. Cyclo can easily get his ult back thanks to his cooldown reduction passive. This show is pretty good. It reminds me of my show. Smiley face. It's important to make the enemies waste their spells such as Purify and whatnot, so the next time it will be a lot easier to kill them. When facing a Granger, try to sidestep his first skill, which is his main source of damage. Don't run straight, keep repositioning. If I would have survived that, that would have been such an epic highlight. Remember guys, don't chase in a straight line against Granger. I thought that Lunox was 100% dead, so I decided to ult someone else instead. As long as our link keeps dying, that's a huge victory for me.
資料になかった顔だ That was clutch. Cho almost ruined my triple kill, and for that reason alone, I think I should have reported him. But since I was in a good mood, I decided to let it go this time. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, consider leaving a like and subscribing. Thanks.